HPK has received the headshot multiply nerf this season and so I decided to try it out. And this is the gunsmith which I used at first which used to be my go to build. And so everything was smooth but the enemy team was just too easy. Like none of them could even get 20 kills which I consider to be like the lowest acceptable amount. And I always check how many kills teammates enemies were obtained have obtained in the match. And if it's like 20 plus then it's good, 30 it is great, even more it is splendid. And so I decided to play more games with this HVK gunsmith. And this firing range match at first it was quite well. Things were going smooth but when we started being just destroyed by the rich users, one Grau user, and they flipped the whole match and they won. Even though it was kind of close but like, as you can see at first we had like huge advantage and when we started just losing. So it was a complete 360. And yeah, this was the final moment. And so as you can see this time, team was doing quite alright, just enemies were, they were stronger at the end. And in this other match we also got matched in the firing range. And this time my team was better.
Yeah, there were moments when the enemy team was at an advantage, but when my teammates would start spamming expensive Skostrix, and I did not even MVP, but it was a pretty good match. But then I've decided to try a different gunsmith variant instead of the KM Light Stock, which was my used to be my go-to. I decided to try out the MAP one instead, and it was one of the recommended gunsmiths by like big YouTubers. And the thing is that it does make your ADS movement speed worse, but improves your ADS bullet spread, hit flinch, and the horizontal recoil. And so considering that the nerf was still like headshot multiplier, I think that by improving the bullet spread accuracy we kind of can compensate for it. And so, yeah, that gunsmith was just the better variant after the nerf, I would say, and all things considered, the HVK itself, it is still meta, it did not become notably worse, however, the ADS increasing, ADS movement speed increasing stock might not be the best right now, because you really can benefit from the extra BSA accuracy, and other than that, also, Die Rage is a serious contender, especially now, and even earlier I made a comparison video where I concluded that it is simply just more like versatile, easier to use, but HVK is still good.